These are half inch comb bindings and these are quarter inch. We're gonna use quarter inch today. Um, so we're gonna make a sketchbook. And so I'm gonna use about enough paper for a quarter inch sketchbook. It's back here. If, depending on the size of your comb binder, it depends on how much paper you can fit in at once. If your comb binder is set up right, I'm gonna make sure that this is on the letter. Thing. So every time I put my papers in, I slide it over there, line it up so that all of my holes align. These two are pulled out because I don't need them for this size. And then I pull down and I have holes. Because it's new, I've got a little bit of oil on this. Um, you'll find if you put too many papers in, it's not gonna pull. Pulling towards me to make holes. And once I have enough paper, we're making sketchbooks, that's why it's all blank paper. Line those up. I like to use transparencies because I mean, everybody's got those lying around from the days of the overhead projector. Line those up in there. It has a nice cover for the front and the back. And like, but it's not a book yet. I know. So this is the comb binder. Maybe if it's not stuck to the tape, there it is. And it opens two ways. If you do it right, and you push the handle back, these little teeth will open up. You see the little teeth? Okay. And you can like put the paper up on the teeth. Make sure it's there. Slowly release it if you need to. Make sure you put all the papers on there. And you have a book. Yay!